What's up YouTube? This is Warfire604 here to give you a very special video. Okay, I made a discovery I think by accident. Okay, I discovered that you can breed Metagross. That's right, you could breed Metagross. That's pretty amazing to tell you the truth. Okay, I'm gonna tell you the full story behind it and how I made the discovery. Okay, I was breeding a Mimikyu. It said it wasn't compatible with Ditto. But a few minutes later, I got an egg from the breeder. And a Mimikyu hatched. So that blew my mind, to tell you the truth. And that got me thinking. Wait a minute. If it can breed Pokemon that are not compatible with it now. <coughs> wouldn't it be able to breed... Like semi legends, legends, maybe even Pokemon that don't have genders. Well, here's the discovery that I made. Okay, the answer is no, you cannot breed semi legends and legends. But I put a Metagross that I got from GTS, which I will show you in a couple minutes. And yeah, look at that. I hatched a Beldum. Which totally blew my mind. So yes, you can breed a Metagross Beldum. That basically means I believe that you can also ma uh, breed Magneton or Magnezone. You could breed your own Magnemites. That is incredible. Like, I cannot believe it. You're seeing it in this video right now that it, it, it can be done. I got the Metagross from the GTS, so it's legitimate. It's unbelievable. Alright, so now that you guys know this, you guys could start breeding as many Metagross, Magnezones, and every other Pokemon that does not have a gender. Go nuts! But please note, you cannot breed Semi-Legends and Legends. Alright, so I hope you enjoyed this. Leave a like for my incredible discovery, and have fun!